That's why. I need a sweatshirt. The cats are on something else this morning, I swear to God. Good morning, everybody. Happy Vlogmas Day 7. I just woke up and got out of bed. I actually woke up at like 8.30 and it's currently 9.30. I was just kind of laying in bed watching some TikToks, just kind of like hanging out. I also started the five minute journal today. So I was like filling out all the like questions for that and like all that fun stuff. Come on, Belle. She's just looking at me from bed. Belly, come on. So I wanted to start the five minute journal. Um, as I've been like talked about a lot that I just don't like feel like I'm in like my best like mental or just like my best state right now. Um, I wanted to start doing the journal, the five minute journal because I've read like a lot of good things about it. Yeah, we're gonna unload some more. Okay, I was vlogging. Oh my gosh. You're all covered in wood. Yeah, I like woke up and I'm like, did he make the bed around me or something? Your side actually didn't look like Yeah, thanks. as bad as it normally does. Uh -huh. Alright, um, I'll be outside. Okay. No, what are you doing? Um, I've actually read like a lot of good things about the five minute journal and that it's like the beginning of the journal is like all this stuff about like why it's good and whatnot. So I figured I'd give it a try. Oh, I just put water all down my sleeve. Oh my god. Oh god. My shirt is soaked. <laughs> the five minute journal, I bought it a couple months ago because I saw it on online on Target's website. I just haven't found the time to actually like start it. And I'm like, you know, what better time than the present? So, I'm going to feed the cats and then I'm going to make something to eat. And then plan out my day because I actually have like a good amount of stuff we have to do today. guys so i ate breakfast let's get ready for my day last night i was like in the shower and the water pressure was like dying off like i don't know like why it was but we kept losing shower pressure and i was like standing in the shower and all of a sudden i have no water like the water was just gone and i'm like standing in here i'm like yelling Corey's name so i'm like standing in the shower there's no water i have shampoo and body wash all over me and i'm just like Corey, Corey, because like I had no water. I have been wanting to do my Christmas wish list. Um, I just had to pick out some things to send to my dad for Christmas. I wasn't really sure if we were doing Christmas on his side this year. So I had to pull out some stuff like, because so I typically I make like a Pinterest board and I send it to Corey and my mom and I'll like pick stuff out that I sent my dad from there. But I just didn't know that we were doing Christmas this year. So I didn't pick anything out. And my mom already started Christmas shopping. I'm not sure if Corey did, but I'm like, okay. Now I gotta think of some stuff off my list to ask my dad for. And I think I'm asking him for, so it's for my birthday and Christmas. So I want a new yoga mat because I really wanna start getting into doing more yoga and I want to try it at home first before I look into the gym. I like the gym and I definitely want to go to the gym just right now I just don't really have the time and with the holidays coming up I just feel like it's going to get worse time wise so I will sadly be joining the like new year new me club at the gym. I've been to the gym before though it's just I just have not had the time to get into the gym. I don't want to pay for something that I'm not going to so I'm just going to do some from home. And once the holidays are over, I feel like I normally don't have too much going on anyway in January and February. And I found some really nice, like, yoga classes on YouTube. So I think I'm just going to, like, tune into those. But yeah, I found this, like, yoga mat. I'll link everything down below if anybody's interested. Um, but I found this, like, half-inch yoga mat on Amazon in the comments. 
and reviews are like so good on it and the floor here hurts like so bad like i have to get on my hands and knees to like dig out cat toys from underneath the couch and like my knees hurt so bad so my yoga mat that i have right now is like from five below which is like a perfectly fine yoga mat i just don't think it's going to be thick enough for these like harder floors next thing that i wanted to ask for was a wireless microphone i want to play with it with like both my phone and this camera um and i found one off amazon that's just like a nice just it seems pretty set straightforward um so i want to get that and then okay but i'll just throw up what was the other thing a new camera battery for this camera because these batteries i drain them so bad um and i've had my camera now for almost seven years and i use it almost every day and the four battery i have currently have three batteries for this camera but they're just two of them are on their last leg because they're like i got them seven years ago and i just bought a new one maybe like a year ago which is good it like still works fine i just want to like get a new one and like mark it and be like this one is perfectly fine i just bought it it should not be draining i gotta keep an eye on the throw up because i found out that my youngest been eating throw up which is disgusting and then the last thing i want to ask for from my dad for christmas is a lululemon belt bag i've never shopped at lululemon before but i've been trying to find like a nice black stapled belt bag and i was just looking around and i was like oh i saw some girl at a store who had a lululemon one and i'm like that's a nice size so i got i found like the bigger ish one from their website so i want to ask for that and that should be everything i was going to ask for from him um for christmas slash my birthday okay so i'm ready for my day just finished getting ready here's my little outfit of the day super comfy i've been dressing kind of nicer with like sweaters and stuff and i was just feeling like a nice comfy super laid back fit the only issue is that this sweatshirt keeps making me feel like i'm like being choked hey <laughs> okay um my sweatshirt is from colorado it says colorado on it i don't know where because Corey got it for me underneath i have a red shirt from walmart that says all <laughs> all cat summer or something all american summer with a cat on it look at him hair sir my sweatpants are from walmart um yeah and that's my fit hello no no and now i'm gonna rinse out my water bottle and text my mom and i think we're gonna go run some errands i gotta sit down though because i think we're going grocery shopping as well so i gotta figure out recipes and what i want to make for the week i texted alexa because i'm supposed to go pick up some stuff for from one of our friends for her friend but she didn't tell me what time so i had to ask what time all right guys so i'm gonna start dinner um it's a little bit later then I would like to initially start a crock pot recipe, but I just haven't just been doing a lot. And then I was sitting down and I was hanging out with Harry because when he like wants to snuggle, I always feel so bad saying no because he's just such a little cuddle bug and I feel bad. So we're making rotisserie chicken noodle soup, which is my favorite like little comfort meal. I'm halving the recipe because last time it just like was way too much. I don't have the huge crock pot. I just have this one that I got from Target, which is still a very nice crock pot. ignore my awful knife skills um i am new to knives i hate knives i've barely cut much growing up
they better just be pruning it. If they cut that tree down, there's too many trees coming down in my area. People gotta be mindful of the trees. Where is the Lorax? I will be. Said Lorax. Can you grab me my glasses? My tail, uh, tailgate didn't come down, right? Oh, I meant to press the hazards button and I pushed the tailgate drop button. <laughs> well, I learned that if I'm driving, it won't come down. Oh, nice. So that was what we learned today. My goal this vlogmas is to like get better at public vlogging. Like in the sense that like I do it more on my phone. Like I always feel awkward vlogging on my phone, but like what's the difference between that? Ow, my hand's stuck. <laughs> What's the difference between that and like just being on FaceTime? Okay, I was talking with Corey and we were cleaning out so I forgot to do a haul but I'm gonna show you what I have in front of me and what I like kind of put in the fridge and everything. So I got two Chef Boyardee cans um, from Weiss. I just liked them. I got some bananas from Sam's Club. Crumble cookies, so good. I got some of the festive Oreos because I just, I love these so much and they got cute little things on them, so sorry I'm out of breath. I was just trying to like spin. Um, I got two cans of corn for a recipe that I'm making. From Bath and Body Works, I got this, like the foaming soap in a refill thing. And I got this from PetSmart for my fish tank. I also got this from Bath and Body Works, the winter candy apple lotion. I got four candles in total, but I got a lemon, the sugared lemon zest, which is my favorite candle. I got bright Christmas morning, and then where's the other one? Butterfly so those three I got and then I also got one that's currently lit There's bell <laughs> um, And then I also got tis the season because it's literally my favorite one during the holidays In candle form also here's a dinner update Here's where we're at for dinner um, Okay, let's move to the freezer. I just packaged up. I got a whole thing of chicken from Sam's Club So I packaged up and stuck it in the freezer and we'll do a little fridge haul. I got some more milk. Um, my milk went bad, so I'm really glad I got that. I got some chicken for sandwiches. I got a lotion, or a lotion. <laughs> I got a yogurt from Sam's. I bought a whole big pack of these craft singles in like a pack of um, three. This one's going to my mom and then I'm saving two. I got more sour cream back there. I got these sausages i cook them and i take them to work with me and they're really good i got another thing of cheese i love cheese <laughs> as you can tell by my cheese drawer i got some more feta for a recipe that i'm making um and as you go down here i got some grapes i got some yellow squash i got some mushrooms um i got a big pack of apples from sam's and then this is our orange drawer <laughs> Um, Corey wanted the big oranges, but I don't like the big oranges. I like the little ones because I can take them to work. So that's his oranges and my oranges. He was eating all my little ones and he, I'm very grateful. He told me he was eating them so I could properly plan for us each to have oranges. Oh, I also got some Dr. Pepper from Sam's and I'm pretty sure that's all that I got. Um, oh, I also got another pajama set from Sam's because I'm like obsessed with these. I also just remembered about this. I completely forgot to move my little thing to the 18 days until Christmas. Okay, dinner is done. There's dinner and I'm super excited. Corey's making me go outside though to look at something. So we're going outside. It's definitely not this bad anymore, but I'm still dressing like it is. Good morning, everybody, and happy Sunday. Today is Sunday. It is December 8th. Um, we have a relatively busy day today. So it's currently 8.24, and I am up relentless, reluctantly. I have to go out dogs, so um, I woke up at 8 and I like laid in bed for like 10 minutes and then I was like if I get up and try to leave the cats are gonna try to kill me so I waited 
so I wanted to feed them before I fully left. But it also makes it easier to get out of the house because they're like locked in the bathroom, so. water pump went bad. It burnt out. Okay. Ooh, it's hot. It is. It All right, I think we're just going to wait to do our boat. I'll stop at home with you okay. and then we'll open them because the lighting here is just not, it's not good. And I got to bring. Yeah. Hi animals. Nobody comes. Hi guys. So I'm at my mom's house. But we got, so there's this like trend that people have done where you like package up a book and like give it to somebody or whatever. I've seen Barnes and Noble do this. So I actually know the girl, I think. I think it's my friend Grace from high school, her older sister. But at the craft fair, she made like the little blind date with a book thing. What? And, are you okay? My dad, you're gonna call on the steps. No. And she included like pens, some highlighters, and like a bookmark. Like it's so cute. But my mom and I both got one, and we're gonna unbox them and show what books we got. My little hints say adult romance, fade to black, small town, good girl, and bad boy. What's I'm so excited? What do you say, uh, mom? Mine is adult romance, STEM, female main character, and enemies to. Ooh, here's my little documentation of what it looks like. I know I also did pick this one, 90% of it was because I love this pen. I love stationery. I'm gonna show mine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then this was my mom's. That was her cover. So, hold on, I'll put my pens back in and show them both. No, they're packaged up so beautifully. Like, so cute. Like and we got stickers too. I like the little sticky notes too. I don't like to annotate when I read. But look at how many. Did you see how many? Oh wow. That's a lot. Yeah, that's awesome. Oh, the guy has tattoos. That's how you know it's gonna be bad. <laughs> They're dangerous. Oh. I've heard of Allie Hazelwood. Oh, what, what like, show? Yes, I've been wanting to read that. <laughs> Yeah, I've heard about that one. I got Practice Makes Perfect. Oh, she's a theoretical physicist. Mom. Nice. That's my book. How, how did we get into romances lately? I don't know. That's so fun though. I ah. literally love it. That was so exciting. 
All right, guys, so I'm now headed home. That was actually really fun. I'm really glad we were able to go this year. There were so many cool things to look at. Um, nothing that I really like wanted to really buy. I did get this ring as I showed you. Um, the one on my pinky finger. I've been looking for rings to fit on my pinky finger because my pinky is so small, but I feel like they never have rings smaller than like a size five. And like a size five is like what my, I believe my ring finger is. It's either a five or a six, but like this, I, it doesn't fit on my finger. It was like a green and I have like all blue and like my rose gold ring that Corey got me. Um, so I was like, you know what? It kind of fit. It kind of fit the vibe. All right, so I just got back from all that. Um, and I'm going to show you some of the things I got from my mom's house because we split a lot of stuff still, as I said, just because she pretty much lives like by herself with Cameron coming and going and I live here with Corey. So we really don't like need that much. Um, so here's what she gave me from like grocery shopping yesterday. I also got a check that I had to pick up. I got some pie crust for Corey's making turkey pot pie. I got two things of butter and she gave me Listerine. So I opened up the back door. Um, that's been locked off to the cats so they can use the bathroom if they need to. Um, since Corey and I have all of them have been coming in and out. Yeah, my little baby. All right guys, so I just finished cleaning out my truck and getting all my jackets out. Um, I might bring one tonight, but we'll see. Um, but it's currently like, what time is it? It's 2.53, we have to leave in like 25-ish minutes. So since we have no water, I can't do any house cleaning stuff. So we're gonna have to wait on that one, but I'm adding my new book to my little book collection that's starting. As I said, I haven't been a reader in a little bit, so I don't have too many books, so excuse me on that, but those are the books I do have. And I've actually read all of them, but Admission and the To All the Boys, or sorry, the, the Summer I Turned Pretty series, I got that last year for Christmas, but I just, um, I also got a Kindle for Christmas. So between the Kindle and those books, I really wanted to play with my Kindle. Here's all my jackets from my truck. I'm probably gonna put them away. I probably should, um, but I really can't do anything cleaning wise because we have no water. So I'm just gonna get myself ready to go um, for the thing tonight, get my camera stuff together, all that jazz, um, cause that's really all I can do right now. Okay, hi everyone. So as you can probably tell, we are not at the fire station. So. Long story short, so I can save my sanity, we walked into the fire station and it was just very unwelcoming. People didn't expect to have us there. And people were overall just like very rude to us. Um, when we mentioned the lady who like got us into doing this, the one guy was like, I don't know who that is. Like she's not in charge of this, like I am. It was just very odd. And then he walked away from us. So I looked at Corey, I was like, you know, we've had a long day here trying to figure out the water, trying to figure out everything. Trying, we figured out the water. We did, We're but we've, we've had a long day. And I'm like, the last thing I wanna do is spend my evening with a whole bunch of people who aren't grateful for us volunteering and being nice. So, we're back now, which I'm not complaining about because I'm actually just, I'm exhausted and just don't wanna do it, but it's fine. So, we're just gonna go to the one that I normally go to with my mom. And then that'll be it. And then I'm gonna go to ladies night at Ace Hardware. Cause I have some things to pick up and I'm gonna go see Lindsay. So yeah, but yeah, kind of disappointing. I was really actually super excited to do the photos, but it's all right, everything happens for a reason. I just won't ever put myself out there again to help our local fire department because it just made me feel really bad. And it really did, I say this not even like it just really overall hurt my feelings. That was pretty much it. I would invite you to come to ladies night with me, but I can't do it yet, so. What?
I just sometimes I need to capture like historical moments. Corey, I do the dishes every Sunday. I know. Good night.